That night, when everyone was sleeping, I got out of bed, and with a light in my hand, I went quietly through the house to Wilson's room. I had been thinking of another of those plans to hurt him, with which I had until then had little success. It was my purpose now to begin to act according to this new plan. Having reached his room, I entered without a sound, leaving the light outside. I advanced a step and listened. He was asleep. I turned, took the light, and again went to the bed. I looked down upon his face. The coldness of ice filled my whole body. My knees trembled. My whole spirit was filled with horror. I moved the light near to his face. Was this, this the face of William Wilson? <laughs>